Hi everyone. Today we are going to be making Nigerian puff puff. Puff puff is one of the most popular snacks in Nigeria. So let's get started. We'll be needing 250 grams of flour, one teaspoon grounded nutmeg, two teaspoons of instant yeast, and one cup of sugar. You can actually reduce the sugar if you are not the sugar type. Three pinches of salt and vegetable oil for frying. We will be needing one cup of warm water because of the yeast. We actually need warm water to sift the flour. Then add all your ingredients. There's no protocol, you just have to add all at the same time. It doesn't really matter whether you add the sugar first or the nutmeg, it doesn't really matter. It doesn't really matter. So you add everything together, give it a quick stir to combine, then add your salt. I have to add salt last because if you add salt directly on your yeast it will be difficult for the yeast to proof we add our warm water and stir stir properly you can also combine this with your hands to be sure there are no lumps. With the spatula, you can as well stay. So you are supposed to have this consistency, not a running, a thick consistency, consistency, thicker than pancake. So after a foil, paper foil, aluminum foil, to actually use clinch film. Anyone can serve the purpose. Cover it properly and leave it in a warm place for 45 minutes. 45 minutes. After 45 minutes, you should have air bubbles. I actually made a little batch because of this video. You can increase the measurement or you reduce the measurement. It's up to you. So you line your plate or tray with paper towel line with paper towel and this is where you are going to put your puff puff after frying to that's just to remove the excess oil excess oil if you don't want excess oil we have to put it in a paper towel. So I actually tested my the heat of my oil by putting a little drop of the butter in the oil. So when you do that and the butter comes up and floats immediately, that means your oil is hot enough. It's hot enough. Flood your frying pan or pot because the puff puff increases in size. Remember, we have instant yeast in our recipe, so yeast helps the puff puff to actually puff up. You know, the flood the oil. I gave it room to fry. So you have to fry to you a golden brown. Okay, that's our puff puff. Looking so yummy. Thanks for watching. See you next time.